Guys, welcome back to Precision Rifle Network. Before we launch into Justin's video today, I want to shout out our title sponsor, and that is Arkin Optics. Guys, make sure you check out Arkin Optics for a lot of great products. Probably one of the best values in the market right now, in my opinion. So follow the link in the description to that and a number of other sponsored companies that we definitely can get behind and promote with honesty. So here we go. Let's get into the video. Hey, thanks for watching Precision Rifle Network. My name is Justin and today I just wanted to show a simple way to make your time at the range a little more worthwhile, um, just to be a little more intentional with it. This is something I am trying to do to plan ahead before I go to the range, think about what I want to work on, but, but I wanted to keep it simple and just stay on a simple 100 yard range that most people have access to and show you how you can work on some of those skills that you um, may see and may use in a PRS or similar competition. So let's uh, let's check it out. I traced out some circles. These are about an inch and a half um, diameter and then I drew some small dots and this is just to zero my gun. I use the dots for zeroing and if I'm shooting on a bench or prone, I'll check zero. You can see here I, this shot was a little low Follow it up with another shot. I would shoot a lot of just large number groups, but I adjust my scope to get it up to zero. Shoot a few more rounds at that dot from the bench to see how those group. And you'll see that here. But I'm trying to not just spend all my time shooting from a bench or shooting prone, since that is a small portion of what a match is about. So here I just, I go prone just to check my zero prone. Sometimes I can shoot a little bit tighter group shooting from prone. So it's a, about a tenth low and tenth left, which I'm good with that being my zero. So here just a simple way, I've got a shooting bench. I've got three positions just as it sits right here. So working from a bag and a bipod, shooting, um, you know, kneeling, modified prone, and then kneeling on the other side just to add something to that. And I'm shooting, this is where I incorporate those circles. They're an inch and a half, so about 1.5 MOA and at 100 yards. You don't have to have a bunch of steel targets at a lot, a lot of different distances. And I love shooting paper because it is, you truly see what your gun is doing. You can see if you're shifting, uh, maybe you're favoring high or low shooting positional and you can use that data to uh, take into consideration when you are shooting a match. So you can see here, I just shot these three positions, not in a big hurry. I wanna work on just fundamentals, breaking clean shots. Um, another simple exercise is take your tripod, throw a bag on it, and here I do two positions. I do a few shots, three shots I believe uh, from from the kneeling position and then three shots from in the standing position. And I just wanted to play with a couple of different bags. So I'm shooting this plus one uh, bag here and then I just switched to a, um, my plate bag just to see how it does and practice shooting from, from the standing position. You know, try new things. This is a good time when you're at the range just to see how different bags feel, how different positions feel. And like I said, not in a big hurry. Just want to work on uh, the fundamentals, uh, follow through trigger press. Um, here I'm using a little more free recoil. So I hope you enjoyed that video. Please like and subscribe if you did. Um, just want to show an easy way. If all you have access to is a hundred yard range, there are still um, ways that you can go and work on PRS related skills. There's a lots of different ways that you can go to the range and um, hone those skills. But this is just a video to show you just some simple ways to make that time worthwhile to, to be intentional with your time at the range and to get out of the just the prone position or modified prone position and try some different things and 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 test your equipment and get used to it get comfortable using uh, different bags different chassis and stocks and 
working on honing those skills to make you a better competitive shooter. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you again soon.